Y'all, I am so mad. I'm mad, but I'm not happy mad. I'll get over it mad. My kids left a whole bag of king crab in my car. You know you can smell something fishy, and you know it ain't you. But you like, who, who been in my car? Who the hell could it be? Because ain't nobody been in here but me. So I'm looking for this smell, looking for this smell. So I'm saying, go to the trunk, girl. Go to the trunk. They done left a whole bag of king crabs in my trunk, child. You talking about disgusting. No one I was going to cook them king crabs tomorrow. So they really got me mad. But then number two. I feel like my trunk open. Number two. There is no number two. I'm just mad, damn it. Okay, so I'm on my way to go to Best Buy. Um, I want to go see what kind of sell JC Penny's having while I'm over there in Best Buy. Oh, I really want to go to Old Navy too. And um, and you know what? I need to take these pants because I need her to take these pants in for me. So I'm gonna go to the tailor first, and then I need to go get my car washed and cleaned. You know what? I don't feel like getting my car washed today. I get it. I had to go and wash my car and then take it to the thing to go get it vacuumed out. Cause I don't feel like paying nobody to wash my car when I can wash my own car. So that's what's on my agenda for today. But yeah, they ran me hot with. Oh, I was that was thirty dollars just gone down the drain. That that vexed me a little bit. I'm a little vexed about that one. But I'll get over it because I know they didn't do it on purpose. But if, when I tell you to t check the trunk. Like, really go check the trunk. Don't just say you looked and you didn't. Because had they looked, they would have found it. So, yeah. Whatever. So, now I'm going to go take care of that. Um, I was going to go to the nail shop. But I just get off in about another two hours. So, by the time I go uh, to the Taylor's, go to Best Buy, go to JCPenney, go to Old Navy, it'll be time for her to get off. And then I'm going to come back home and chill for the rest of the day. I don't feel like doing nothing. Like, I, well, I probably go with my cousin if she get through in time. One of my cousins, which I met a long, 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 long time ago, but she ain't been back on camera in a while. Um, my cousin Jazz, I might go with her to um, go get this tattoo covered up. But then I be feeling like I'm finna be in parallel anyway, so I could let them cover this tattoo right quick. But then I'm kind of feeling like I really don't want them to touch me. I'd rather the old boy do it. So, yeah. The dude that did this uh, piece right here, I'd rather him um, do it. So, I will see. Right now, I just want to be around my kids, my family. I don't want no extra people in my presence. So, you know what? Matter of fact, I need to text this dude and see when he can do it. I'm just sitting here while y'all watch me while it takes. I'll be big. I'll, I'll be big. Let me take care of this. Okay, y'all. Good morning. On my way to take Audrey to work and run a few errands. And this damn boob tape is getting on my nerves because I ain't feel like putting on no bra. But I ain't know it's going to be extra. Okay, so I think I got everything I need. I had a few errands to run before I come back home and clean up. Had a date, but I canceled it. I just didn't want to go. He was giving me red flags already. So, you know, when you get red flags, you need to listen to them. Like, too needy, too whiny. I'm 40 years old. I got babies. I can't take on another one. So, I canceled that date, blocked him, and deleted him. Um, you talking about the same person? PJ? Uh, yeah. So, yeah. I just, you know what? It's like, I feel like I already got a connection with somebody else, so why even go on a date? I don't want to. I just rather be in my house cleaning up. I'm going out with my girls today, so I'm good. 
Ty just was to go out with her girl today, but we ended up going to Rainbow and her friend, I don't know what happened. Um, but hopefully her friend can spend the night sometime soon because we really miss her. Um, but yeah, we're not, I'm not doing nothing today until four o'clock. I had, you know, I just, I don't know. I am, you know what? I'll, okay, so here's the deal. I was gonna go on this date, but then I was like, you're happy where you are, even though it's not the ideal situation. I'm happy where I am, and why deal with, for me, what I feel like to be drama? If you get red flags that give you an indication that there's gonna be drama, don't even entertain me. And I'm at the age now, I can't entertain nobody drama. I don't got time. So before I do that, I'll just cancel some stuff. So, yeah. I'm really picky and selective now about who I date. Especially being a 40 year old single woman with a daughter in her house, even with my boys, but especially my daughter in my house. I'm very um, particular about who I allow myself to be around and allow my children to be around. Not to say that my children have only been around one person and they, they absolutely adore him. So that's how we're going to keep that. But yeah, now I'm on my way to drop her off. I need to go by Ross. I need to go by um, possibly Target. Um, definitely HEB because I need to get my Sunday's dinner stuff. I want to get everything today. So when I get home, when, when, when tomorrow rolls out, I don't have to do nothing but cook dinner, chill out. That's all I'm trying to do tomorrow. I'm not trying to do nothing extra tomorrow with my time. So... not really doing much or nothing today really just chilling letting life lead as you want to get in the camera and say hi real quick just real quick baby all right she's not in a good mood today so i respect her space um but yeah i'm gonna get ready to drop her off and then i'll try to take y'all along while i'm in target i'm trying to get used to this vlogging in public type of thing y'all know um, but I know you. a lot of you guys want to see when we go in the stores, what we're getting, what we're picking up and stuff. And I think since it's vaguely quiet and nobody's really up today, I think I can go ahead and just bring the camera in there with you. So we'll see. Don't hold your breath, but I'm just saying. I'm going to try. All right, y'all. I'm going to get out of here. I definitely have a clean with me video coming because my room needs to be organized. So I would definitely be doing a clean with me video today. Um, but as soon as I get to these stores, we'll debate if I'm going to turn this camera on or not. So I will see you guys in a few. Today is a no makeup day, honey. And she still look good. Babe, I'm putting a hurt on 40. You, uh, it's people out here wish that they look like this at 40. So I'm putting a hurt on 40 right now. No makeup, no nothing. No, y'all probably get your eyebrows, but they not. They tattooed on. Don't come for me. All right, <laughs> let me get out of here. I'll see y'all when I get to the stores. Okay, y'all. So, I did it again. I went into Rouse, and I was like in and out. Like, seriously. I was not even in there five minutes. I went in and I got some hangers and came back out. Now I'm in Mako's. I don't know if they're going to let me film this process. But I'm in Mako's. Yeah, my shirt is all wrong. I'm, huh, I'm trying to go braless, and I got this tape, and it's pissing me out. Okay. That was probably too much information, but oh well, this life, y'all need to know what's going on behind the scenes. So, first of all, so y'all see that? That's the tape. That's to do better. Next time, I'm just going to do a strapless bra and get it over with, okay? Um, well, I'm waiting for them to open. I have an estimate. They're going to do an estimate on painting my car. I was going to wait till the 22nd to get the estimate, but I plan on having my car painted this weekend before I go on vacation so I'm gonna let them do an estimate on my car see how much it is cuz I was y'all know what let me give y'all some real stuff my glasses are cricket for some reason they really are okay there we go okay so the real spill they still cricket I don't know how to fix that so the real spill is I was gonna buy a new car 
But I was like, what do you need a new car for? Your car works perfectly fine. It'd be different if I needed a car. It'll be different if I, if this car was on its way out. But this car ain't number 2018. This car is what, four years old? Four years old. There's nothing wrong with this car. But anyway, I was gonna go buy a new car. I was gonna get this, um, it was either gonna be this Kia Optima or I was gonna do another black. I was gonna do a Kia Soul in black with the same features as this. So I'm like, are you done? Just go ahead and paint your car the color that you want to paint it. And there you have it. Now I do, if probably in the next four months, I do plan on purchasing another car. I plan on taking cash and going to buy a new car. Cause I'm not doing another note. But for right now, I don't need a car. I just wanted a car. Just like I, you know, y'all know me. Y'all know I do a lot of stuff just off of the spare of the moment. I live in the moment. So when I want something, I get it. And that's not good. Okay. Especially now that I'm getting older and I realize that nothing's promised to you. Like one minute you can have a job, the next minute you can't have a job, you won't have a job, or one minute you'll have a home, the next minute you won't. Nothing's promised. And the way my life's set up, I need to make sure that I keep track of all my coins. So with that being said, I'm not gonna buy a car right now. I am gonna buy a car in about four or five more months, maybe three, no, about five, four or five more months, maybe six. Um, Cause right now, this is what I can know for sure. All the lemons are out because they know everybody got their stimulus, everybody got their taxes. They know this, so I'm gonna let all them dummies. What I call the people dummies? I'm just shoot. I'm just shoot straight. I ain't finna hit. I'm gonna let all them fools go buy cars because they should know better. And then I'm gonna wait because around a certain time of the year is when is when it's good to purchase cars because the APRs are super low, the um, purchasing price is super low, and they're more at willing to wheel and deal with you around that time i have to look it up but I, i'm thinking it's um in the winter months i'm not sure but um just now is not a good time to buy a car especially since i have ran up a chick i have ran up a bag <sighs> shopping knowing i don't need to y'all know i don't need to buy nothing i just be doing stuff and it, it's not because i it's out of sheer boredom Let's be honest. I be bored. When I'm bored, I spend money, which is not good. I need to learn how to um, transfer that energy somewhere else instead of out of my instead of my pocketbook. So that's what I'm working on. I have made some good investments as far as shopping, investment pieces that I can use for a very, 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 very long time. But nonetheless, they were unnecessary. Just like on hair, I've spent like. 1500 on hair unnecessary but y'all know me i like to switch up my look i don't like to have the same look but that stuff i could wear every day so to me it's not it's not being frivolous in a sense okay it is but that's the whatever it's my coin i just need to do better with my coin you know i don't need nobody to tell me what to do with my coin i just know i need to do better with my coin because the spending that i'm doing with my coins is unnecessary and i'm wasting money so yeah these people supposed to open at nine hold on i'm gonna see what time it is it's 8 57 okay but yeah now i'm just sitting in a parking lot i don't know i think i want to either do a dark dark gray or a black i'm not sure so that's why I'm coming to get the estimate just to see the different colors they have so I know what to choose from, what I want to choose from. Um, my interior on the inside of my car, as you can see, is black. I'm going to get my window, my uh, rims blacked out. Like, y'all. Y'all know how much I save not having no band. Because <laughs> I feel like I was spending more money than I was getting no shade no tea i ain't trying to put nobody down or nothing but i feel like i was spending way more than i was getting and i've been saving a ton of money since i ain't had no man want to know why because both of them both of my oldest got jobs so they don't need mama to do nothing but come off the clutch every now and then i still every now and then like yesterday get my baby girl toes done i still you know get our hair and stuff done for 
she'll buy her clothes and her shoes and stuff that she want. I think I gotta buy her a pair, still gotta buy her a pair of shoes this week, cause I promised her those. But, and then she has her photo session and stuff coming up for her birthday, so I gotta book all that. But other than that, honey, I've been saving tons of money, not messing with these dudes out here in these streets. Now, if he got his own bag and he well equipped for life and he take care of his business, then that ain't no stress on me. But when you used to being the breadwinner in a sense because you make the most money in the household then that's a it's, it's not a problem but it's a problem because i feel like your hustle should match my hustle and i feel like if your hustle don't match my hustle as the man of the house you should make sure that your hustle is either on par with my hustle or over my hustle but my hustle should never be here I feel now people may feel different, but that's just how I feel. So yeah, it feel good to only have to take care of really two people, me and my youngest baby, which is Lil Red. So yeah. Y'all be running my mouth. Y'all probably be like, he, your way of thinking is so crazy. It is because I re I require so much more than a chick. Do you understand me? When it comes to a man, I require a lot. And it's not even, like I said, it's not even financial. It's time. It's respect. It's love. It's, it's so much that comes in play when it comes to what I need. That I'm not playing with these dudes in these streets in 2021. Like, I, I will cut off game super strong. I will... God bless the dude that get with me because he gonna be blessed. Because I am... A vibe. I'm a whole mood. I'll, I'll change your life. But in a sense, the dude that F up, because he on some stupid stuff. Mm, mm, mm. Bless the spirit. Alright, y'all. I think it's 9 o'clock. I'm finna go in here and see if I can get an estimate on my car and see how much they gonna charge me to paint my car. Because if not, it might just get wrapped. Because ain't nobody got time for that. So we'll see. I will be back. Okay, y'all. So... You probably like, Key, what's going on? Girl, my hair's brighter. And it's gonna go on a wig. A wig is gonna go on his head. <sighs> Getting dressed. Y'all, because I couldn't back out of this if I tried. <laughs> so, I'm just gonna get dressed and get ready to go. <sighs> Y'all don't wanna go. I'd rather be in my house. Not really, but really. I'm some real tough girl, not none tough girl type of stuff. I'd rather be with a certain person, but whatever. So I'm finna make the best of the situation and who knows what the night might bring. So this night will be very, very interesting. I can't wait to see what may or may not transpire. I am coming to terms that I don't want to be an option. I want to be the only option. And if I can't be the only option, I don't. I'm going to do me. Like, that's what the freak I'm going to do. So, I'm going to get ready to get dressed. Get my hair done. Not really doing any makeup today, I don't think. We're just going natural. We're hitting them with the natural look. I just, I don't want to put on no makeup. I just want to be my natural self. So, as soon as I get dressed, I will be back. My lips are really moisturized. They're really, really super soft. Yeah, this big old head and all, I'm still cute. Alright, so let me get dressed and I will be back. 